hello all welcome to the channel this is b square and today i'm gonna show you how to check a safe door breaking point so here you can see i have a safe and today we will apply a force on this region and we will check the breaking point of this door so I am starting the tutorial so go to simulation click here new study and static study now here we have some parts here but uh, we just need uh, uh, two part only that first one is my door and second one is my frame so other part we don't need right now so I am just right click here and here you can see one option exclude from a analysis so just do it ok now here uh, we have ok now fine here we have the two part only so first i am applying the material so this is my frame so i am applying material that is uh, this one uh, 316 stainless steel sheet for frame and uh, also for the door so i am applying can now apply and close now material we applied now fixture fixed geometry and we will fix the this frame this frame is behind the door okay so simply fix the okay now we applied the load uh, force and uh, we applied only this uh, rectangular portion here force and my force value is uh, 3 kN applied and simply mass here right click create mass and just click ok ok fine and I am in study property and my this one is large displacement and slower is automatic and simply run Okay, we have the result. Just double click on chart. Go down and get here floating in definition megapascal. Okay, right. Here you can see my yield stress is uh, 172, and this is my maximum stress that is uh, 107. So it means when I applied uh, 3 kN load so this door won't break up or fail so I just need to increase the value of the force so let's say I'm applying 5500 Nm load and run this study again okay now we have the result here you can see my 
maximum stress value is uh, more than the yield strength so it means when i applied a 5500 newton load that time my door will be fail so if you want to see animation just right click and animate this is my displacement 3.84 mm so this is the how you can check okay so thank you for watching thank you all